Meanwhile, up near Canada. Oh, never mind. It's me and Hank. Connor and Hank. Hank has got the best clothes. Is everything okay, Lieutenant? Chris was on patrol last night. He was attacked by a bunch of deviants. He said he was saved by Marcus himself. Huh. Is Chris okay? Yeah, he's in shock, but he's alive. Um... How did you find Kamsky? I remember this guy was all over the media when Cyberlife first started selling androids. I made a few calls. Here we are. <laughs> nice doorbell. It's on the NBC. When they NBC? When they used to... When I used to watch TV? Hi. What's up, girl? I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. Isn't that the chick that helped us out at the beginning okay. of the game? By setting up our options and shit? I think it was. I didn't know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. Thanks. No, I don't want to sit down. I want to look at this fucking picture. Okay, so he founded Cyberlife. Got it. Huh. So, Amanda's dead. Space tourism on the rise. Nice place. South like fortune teller computer. These androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. Nope. Well, hell, I saved your life multiple occasions. You're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? Um, distant. I don't know. I'll tell you when I see him. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Well, I would not say where you are. There's nothing else to look at. What? Why do you want me to stand up? We've already looked at everything. Oh. See? Actually, I think this is pretty legit. A little tree inside with a little zen garden underneath it. That's pretty cool. Elijah, want to cherry the fuck up? Elijah, we'll see you now. Okay, good. Oh shit! I hear you, Elijah. He got a house full of these bitches. Kamsky. Just a moment, please. Is he butt ass naked? Oh, no, I got short time. What's up, ladies? Can I scan y'all? Can I do anything? Not a thing. He's living a fucking life here, isn't he? Really, you just gonna do a couple more laps? It's like you don't give a shit? Okay. I see you. I see you got a hell of a view. All right. Yep, Hank, enjoy that view. Hurry the fuck up, Elijah. Thank you. You and your man bun. Shama flama shama. Flama flama shama dama. 
Doet me de kamer flamme samen, gamma, gamma, gamma. Why your pool like blood? Huh? That's the I'm first Lieutenant question. Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Yep. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. And now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't it ironic? Don't you think? Um, help. We need to understand how androids become deviants. Do you know anything that could help us? All ideas of viruses that spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Whose side are you on? Um, I'm gonna be direct with you. Side, of course. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. What do you really want? I am... I'm a little troubled. What I want is not important. Chloe? I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. Ah, uh, hell. What interests me? whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. A flower that will never wither. What is it really? He's a plastic containing a human. Or a living being. With a soul. It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spirit, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Hmm. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? I'm trying to think about what, who you are. what would Connor do? Not what would I do. An obedient machine. Our living being endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. Hank does not want me to shoot. And Hank's my homie. Nope. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. I'm... I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. No, I was listening to Hank. All right, let's get this straight. Empathy. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? 
get out of here. Well, the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. Hmm. So he is it, what was it? What would he say in there that he could kill all the fucking Why machines with the? Cause you told me not to. I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Well, maybe you did the right thing. Whew, all right. I did what Hank wanted. That's all I was trying to do. Okay, so. Most people wouldn't have shot that bitch. Right? Most people wouldn't have. Let's see. Yeah, 85% of people didn't shoot. I should have shot her. Fuck. But you know, whatever. I'm playing this game the way I want to play it. You know, it's... I'm not playing it only to get new... Oh, no one's ever done this, so let me punch myself in the dick. Nah. Yeah, we had to move out of the boat. We got to be in some of these buildings by now. Am I playing? Oh, I am. Android Riot. The Easter Space Race. It zoomed in. VR MMORPG reaches 1 billion users. Holy shit. Can I read? I want to read more. No, I don't care about that. I don't care about that. Well, I want to read about the game, but fuck that. Anything else up here? Enjoy some alone time. Oh shit, a Flow Rider concert. <laughs> yes, it says Florida. I get that. Alright, you picked up a broken ass mirror. What else can you do? That's it? That's the only thing you can do when you're alone? Oh, I could I could look out over over the city. It looks actually really peaceful with the snow and shit like that. How'd you get in here? Hair still all up under all those layers. I was where you were. I don't know why. You ain't been numbered a little bitch. I just needed to be alone. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people, and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. They all obey me. They follow me without question. And that much power feels good. And scary. At the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. What I did. Humans are terrified. You wanted to kill a bunch of people, crazy bitch. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Listen, I'm optimistic. No, not all humans are the same. Some of them understand that they can't stop us from becoming free forever. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? It was pretty good, actually. I'm gonna tell you the truth. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. 
He showed me that humans and androids can live together. What about you, bitch? What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. You can trust me, girl. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. I just want we to understand all have you more. Something we want to forget. But you need to know where you come from to know who you are. Damn. I'm, I was nothing. I'm spitting hot game to her. Ooh! All in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. Well, they did a good job. All right. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. Why well, don't that feel good? I should have told you. Listen, I'm going to connect to you now. So just give me your hand. See, how's that feel? I'm taking over your mind, bitch. You will do what I say. Remove thine clothing. I... I saw your memories. Oh my god! House, when they left you for dead in his studio. I saw your memories too. The Eden Club. The death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. Did we just become best friends? North. So we went from neutral to lovers just like that. So there's really no way to fuck that up because they gave me so much credit with her right there in that conversation. Like every little thing I said was like a. Wait a minute. Well, fuck. Hopefully you're not pissed. By the way, that's the dude I left on the roof, if you don't remember. Are we good? What's his name? Simon? We good, Simon? Yes, we're good. We are good. They didn't get him? It's good to have you back. With the hole in your chest. This motherfucker wears the baddest. This Look at him. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. Rally your people. There are androids here. Who could join us? Let me look behind me. Who could join us? The more we are, the stronger our message. Yeah. Are you an android? You are. Excuse me, sir. Hey, motherfucker. You work for me now. You're free. He's like, oh shit. All right, then I'm going to the house. <laughs> I'm the fuck out of here. Android, you are now free. You're free. So you can stand in my fucking android all night? Alright, none of y'all are androids? Come on, androids! Oh, there's one. Guess what? You ain't gotta carry this bitch's bags no more. Let's go ahead and leave her shit right there. There you go. Oh! Oh, hi! You think you're just gonna guard this door? Oh, 
You think you're just gonna guard this door? You're awake now. There you go. Anybody else? Did I get everyone? I think I did. Hey, that's everybody. We Gucci. Let's go. Let's go. First things first, we gotta find a couple more androids. One like you. You're with me. A hey, purple. You're free. Don't get on that bus. There you go. Y'all think you're getting on the bus? Nope, not today. You not today. To you either. It's your pretty ass hair. Let's you're go. Free. Anybody over there? Marcus. <gasps> we should find a way to block the road. Well, no shit. Did you just talk to me in my in my brain hole? There's a guy over here. I want to talk to him. Hey, motherfuckers! Can't talk to y'all yet. All right. Find some more androids. Find some more androids. I'ma find. I'ma find some more androids. Do 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 do. Find some more androids. Hey. Put his shit down. You don't work for him no more. You're free now. Hey, where do you think you're going? You get back here. Leave him alone. He's chosen to be free. <laughs> he was like, "Oh shit!" I need to block the street. Be careful. I'm trying to figure out if this is better or worse for the androids, to be honest, because they're, I mean, they're all kind of slaves to me now, because I'm taking over, it feels like I'm just taking over control of their mind. Was there any androids over here? No? These? Fuck that, I'm not opening that shit yet. I'm they don't want me to save y'all, I'm sorry, I'm trying. I'm trying to save you. Come on. Eh. Eh. Huh. All right, y'all bring your asses out the out the sewer. Who the fuck were those people? I don't even know. I guess convert more androids. All right, there we go. Can I convert y'all from far away now? You're free now. Oh shit, your boy has got some new powers. You're with me. You bring that ass over here. We don't listen to you no more. We do what we want to do. Convert motherfuckers while we on the march is what we gonna do. 45 people in the ranks, 45 booties, I'm a spank. Bring your ass to the march today and we gonna be free. We gonna be free, you and you. Come with me, you too, you will see. Everything is beautiful when you're with me. Oh hell. Are we still moving? We ain't stopping. We ain't stopping. I have a feeling I'm about to... My feelings about to get hurt. My power is getting more strong because I don't even have to charge it up anymore. I just got to hit it. I feel like it's going to be this peaceful shit and a damn missile or a rocket is going to just plop right in my fucking lap. Freedom for our people. Damn, they recording? I said we putting this shit on Instagram. What the hell are you doing here? Hey. Bring Disperse. it. Disperse immediately. Bitch, we ain't stopping. That's an order. 
We will not stop. Can't stop, won't stop. That's a bad mistake. Jesus fucking Christ. Yep. That's what I thought. Move that ass out the way. This bed's is control 457. Well, I got a lot of androids down here. Yep. I don't know. Hundreds. Thousands. Freedom. They're marching. Freedom. Yeah, they're marching down the street. Equal rights, baby. Set us free. We are people. We are alive. We want freedom, baby. Shit just got real. Marcus? Marcus. You might just got everybody killed, but we'll see. All right, we will see. Whew. I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting a little bit nervous because I could really fuck everything up right here. I'm scared. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Fuck. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, even if it means dying here. Dying here won't solve anything. Marcus, we need, we to, need to run. Now, yep. It's too Fuck, late. I got a choice to make. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. Fuck you! To show them we won't back down. We stay right here. Kill us. Let's kill us all. Let's go. Disperse! This is your last chance! We have to make a statement. We have to stay put no matter what. See, the public is... Please, Marcus. We can't let them slaughter us without fighting back. We are not We're backing not down. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Marcus, what are you doing? They're gonna kill us all. I will get myself killed, all right? For y'all. Damn. Oh shit! John! Damn, John, you got fucked Wait. up. They're coming. Thanks for the help, John. Sorry about your face and your brains. The public loves us now, though. All right, that was worth it. Sacrificing some people. Simon, survive, okay, blah, blah, blah. God, a lot of shit could have happened. John gave his life to save Marcus because I saved him in spare parts. 38%. Oh, shit. 46% of people sacrificed themselves. 38 had John save him. So that's pretty, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Connor's about fucked up. Amanda, listen. I know you're dead, first off. I seen a picture with your dead ass body in it. 
Second off, how are you standing on a... You just stand out there on the frozen ass water? If I fall through here, I'm gonna be mad as shit. Fuck it. Whoo, I'm a little nervous. I know you're an android, chick. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. Ah, shit, something's locked. I thought Kemsky knew something. Ugh! I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Um... I Listen. chose not to play his twisted little game. There was no reason to kill that android. I saw you dead I saw ass picture. Of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why mm -hmm. he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? This place? Did Kamsky designed this place. He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? You didn't because. tell me everything you know about deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Me and Amanda about to fight. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? Any doubts or conflicts? Do you feel anything for these deviants? Or for Lieutenant Anderson? Fuck yes! I've started having thoughts that are not part of my program. I've considered the possibility that I might be compromised. You've been confronted with difficult situations. It's no surprise you're troubled. That doesn't make you a deviant. Well, this bitch don't trust me. Oh God, what has happened? Case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time. I'm sure we Hank, can. Hank, you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. Fuck that. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. I have a feeling it's not. Luckily, me and him are friends. Because that unlocked a new path for us. Listen, Hank. I know we've had our ups and downs. But we homies. Like, we brothers. I'm frustrated. You can't just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? Huh. When the deviants rise up, there will be chaos. We could have stopped it. Now it's too late. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. I 
I'm troubled. I don't know why I did it. I'm not programmed to say things like this, but I really appreciated working with you. With a little more time, who knows? We might have even become friends. Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. <laughs> don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know this solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. Fuck, I'm not ready. I'm not ready for this. I got five fucking minutes to figure some shit out. The key to Fuck. The basement is on my desk. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. Take the keys from Hank's desk. Come on, give me fucking control. Thank you. Hurry to archive room. You fucking cocksucker! Run. Can you please run? God. Okay, we gotta hurry the fuck up. We gotta hurry the fuck up. We gotta hurry the fuck up. Hurry the fuck up. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Fuck! What? Where are you going? Wouldn't need any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? Fuck you, I'm leaving. Hey, asshole, I'm talking to you. I don't give a shit. Oh shit, don't go that way. Don't go that way. Go this way. Walk down the stairs. There you go. Whew! Don't be coming out here fucking with me. I ain't got enough time. Where am I trying to go? Alright, right there. There's the key. There's the key. Use the key. Use it. We've had all this time to access this evidence. And now... Oh, use the panel. There we go. I'm gonna figure it all out in five it's minutes. Hard-boiled eccentric police lieutenant shoes. Fucking password. <laughs> yes. Yes. Where oh my god. Go? Alright, I gotta scan each one of these things. Send me somewhere. Hurry up, examine that shit. Four seven one seven G. The two traces from Eden. All right, this dead bitch. Are they headed to Jericho? Did they know how to get there? All right, so hang on. He needs a. F I can. Okay, this pause is good. He needs a 4717. She does not have it. She needs a 6755. He does not have it. All right, so I don't have to kill either one of those to do it. Let's see what's right here. Statuette. Let's look at this. Nothing. Great. Wasting my fucking time. Marcus, all right. Why? We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. I already know what he said. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and animals. This is time that's going by. This Fucking put it down. Hope of a people. Fuck! You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus. Yes. Where are you hiding? Jericho, no shit. Put it down. Hurry the fuck up. Put it down. Oh my god. How much time is left? I never look. Can I? Have I decrypted this diary yet? For the love of God. But it's useless. It's encrypted. Well, shit. Does this help me? Decryption key? Play? Oh, 
Oh my god, Connor! Okay, I'm exiting. Alright. Oh good, 414 left. Good, I still got a lot of time. Impossible re Okay, so she's- I can rip all her titties and shit off. Oh good, she's got the 6755, which I need. What about him? Okay, he's just parts two, so he's fucked. 4717, I think that's one of the things I need. Hurry up, examine. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. Okay. He must have known where the deviants are hiding. Okay, so he can't come back. 3983. Alright, I need a... Alright, what do I need? A 3983 from him. For him. Does anybody have that? 3983. That motherfucker does. And he needed a 4717. Alright, so I'm gonna grab a 4717, question him, then I'm gonna rip his shit out. Yep. Come on, I need this. 4717. Give me that. Eh, give me that shit. All right, good. Fuck you. Run. Run. Put it in. Good morning, sunshine. How you doing? My timer's going down. Can you hear the fuck up? I, I was scared. I know. That's why I shot you. I, I didn't mean to destroy you. I didn't want to hurt anyone. I know. It's okay. It's I okay. Need to find Jericho. Do you know how to get there? No. No, I don't know anything about Jericho. Well, fuck you then, bitch! Wasting my goddamn time. What did he need? Wait a minute. I think he needed this. A 398 something? Eh, give me that shit. Just in case. I'm gonna go ahead and take it in case it's wrong. Damn, I'm good. Now, X. Wake your ass up. Hello? Come to. Come to, Sleeping Beauty. It's dark. That's all right, you don't need to see. Where? Where am I? I need your help. I reactivated you so you could help me. I must find Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I should have tell you what Jericho I should have lied. I fucked now up. Leave me alone. Try to trick him. Wait a minute. Try to trick him. Okay. Three minutes and 33 seconds. What'd that bitch need? I don't remember. Fuck, I don't remember. I think it's 6755, am I right? Yeah, 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 I'm right. All right, I gotta take a 6755. Come on! Jesus Christ! I'm really stressing the fuck out. I'm stressing out. Tracy. Yeah, I'm sorry. I shot you in the stomach. I apologize. Where's Tracy? I'll make Tracy's a deal with you. Not far away. I can take you to her. But first, you have to tell me how to find Jericho. I remember you. Fuck. No. I killed one of y'all. Disconnect me. I'd rather be dead than live without her. Well. Try to trick her. How do I try to trick her? Fragile neck. <laughs> yeah! Rip this bitch's head off! Uh, uh, come here! There you go. Shove that up my ass. 
you go. <laughs> My love. Yeah. I thought you were dead. Oh, she's fucked up. Mm-hmm. We'll be free. Yeah. I promise. Tell me where Jericho is. Oh, Give that's creepy. Here. Yeah. Tell me. Oh, squeeze some titties too. Oh, there we go. Give me that information, bitch! Appreciate it! Appreciate it! What's happening? Uh, 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 uh. Tracy! <laughs> You've been Tracy. outsmarted. Shut the hell up. I don't need that fucking head. I've been dreaming about this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the deviants. You're off the case. And now, it's gonna be definitive. <laughs> Woo! Motherfucker. Come on, give me. Right one! Down! Oh, yes. Okay, I got a left two. There we go. We we on it. We on a mission now. Triangle. Circle. X. A square. Woo! Oh, I fucked that up. The fuck that. Get that shit up off me. I'm a bad man. I just bitch slapped him unconscious. That's the kind of bad motherfucker I am. What happened here? Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh, shit. Get the alarm. Now! Oh, damn it. Hank, we gotta go. Whoo! That was stressful as fuck. Okay. So we gotta we gotta look through this, because there was a lot of shit that could have happened in here. 64% of people got to where we were. Most everybody located Jericho. Hmm. Call us Android's memories. Use friendly approach. That didn't go anywhere. Found in the nest. Huh. Damn, so there was a bunch of different things that could have led to this. So there's only one path that we had that would have worked. And that was the one taking off that bitch's head. That was pretty sick. Oh, my hands are sweating because I thought we was about to get killed or fail. Wow. Yeah. Watching cartoons up in my room. Watching cartoons up in my room. Yeah. Watching cartoons up in my room. Watching cartoons up in my room. Yeah. Watching cartoons up in my room. Watching cartoons up in my room. Yeah. Watching cartoons up in my room. 